Hey everyone, welcome to this uh, shortwave radio channel and this is uh, finally here the famous uh, Reticus TR618 the famous radio that's actually said on the e e e eBay seller page that it's a radio for the elderly <laughs> so um, what's in the box? Well, it's very simple the box <laughs> you have the radio which actually is very nice looking. I have to say that it's beautiful looking little radio. And uh, yeah, there's an SD card here because I tested the audio quality of it. Comes with a simple few page manual that explains uh, how the radio works. And has a power cord because it has a internal power supply. So you can actually plug it into the mains of your um you know in 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 the socket and uh it actually works so when you turn it on a little power here and uh, it's actually so this is just to give you an idea right now 15770 the um wrmi with the broadcast of the uh supreme master tv and i'm indoors with the telescopic So, you know, you already hear this. Anyways, you'll see a lot of videos coming up today. I'll be listening to shortwave the rest of the day with this. And also be tuning the medium wave band tonight. And, uh, of course, trying a little bit of FM on it. So this is a radio that has three bands. FM. It has... Uh, FM starts at 87 megahertz up to 108. It has AM from 520 to 1710 expanded AM band. And shortwave is covered from 6 to 18 megahertz. So there are some missing uh, frequencies in the lower uh, frequency range, like you don't have the 60 meter band. And uh, well, above, uh, it doesn't go above 18, so it doesn't have 13 meter band. Not a big emission, but you know, it's uh, kind of a restrain. But in between, it, it, it actually will tune everywhere. Uh, it's an analog radio, but it is interesting because. Uh, I'll read a little more on this. It uh, seems to be using that DSP radio chip because tuning sounds like the tuning of a DSP radio, but with, of course, an analog needle on the radio. So very beautiful. Uh, I'll have a full review of this coming up in the next couple of days. And uh, this radio also has a um, MP3 player. It can play from a USB key. Or USB thumb drive, it can be, uh, it can actually play from an SD card. That's why I've got my SD card here, trying it with some MP3s on it. It can uh, also, um, of course, um, it has, you know, nice sound and everything, but like I said, we're gonna have more. It uses either mains power or you have three batteries, three uh, D batteries that go in there. And there's even an headphone jack here on the left side, on the right side of the radio, sorry. Power here, so nothing much, not very fancy. Simple to operate probably, and that for uh, the elderly is probably what we want. Uh, the display here is only when you actually turn it on and use the um, MP3 playback. It says hi-fi and then it starts playing whatever you have on the MP3, which is the uh, start of the uh, intro song that we have from uh, Radio Activity. So um, it that display does not work while you're tuning shortwave. Uh, it displays nothing. Uh, it would have been nice if it could have displayed maybe the frequency of where you're tuned, but it doesn't. Um, so uh, it's really just for the use of the MP3 playback on uh, SD card and USB thumb drive. Nice looking and uh, lots of videos coming up. So uh, hang in there, guys. Uh, it's coming up tonight. I'm going to listen to shortwave, have you guys listen to some of the signals on shortwave, and I'll give my opinion. So uh, I'm already surprised that the power from the mains doesn't actually induce a lot of noise. It seems to be f pretty filtered there. And so, but I will be using it with batteries to make sure that it's the cleanest, quietest conditions possible. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching, and this is the uh, quick look at the uh, Reticus TR618 AM FM 
shortwave radio for for the elderly as they say <laughs>